Jack and Logan are chapter house roommates. Last week, they invited Michael, who doesn't live in the chapter house, to study in the house library with them. No one wore a mask, and they all worked on the same computer. Today, they heard that Michael had tested positive for COVID-19. Are Jack and Logan okay? Living with others carries some risk of contracting virus-borne illnesses like colds, flu, and COVID-19. But knowing how these diseases spread and the common sense things you can do to prevent and contain them can break the chain of infection. Pathogens are the infectious agents that cause illness. They spread through direct contact, indirect contact, inhalation, and ingestion. To keep from getting sick or making others sick, wear a mask, practice physical distancing, and wash your hands frequently. If you feel sick or think you're exposed to someone who is sick, seek medical advice. Monitor your symptoms and avoid others. You can break the chain of infection through early diagnosis and treatment. As the director of the National Institute of Allergy and Infectious Diseases has said often, we've got to realize that we are a part of the process. We can be either part of the solution or part of the problem. Back to Jack, Logan, and Michael. Looking back on it, everyone should have worn masks, used disinfectant wipes on the keyboard, and used a larger screen so they could sit farther away from each other. But are Jack and Logan okay? That depends in part on their own health. Your health impacts whether or not you become infected, and if you do, how severe your symptoms will be. Eat healthy and exercise. Get at least seven to eight hours of sleep every night to boost your immune system. Avoid smoking. Young adults that smoke, vape, or use marijuana are up to two times more likely to be hospitalized or die from COVID-19. Working together, we can create a culture of infection control in our chapter facilities, during chapter activities, on campus, at home, and away for ourselves and others. For more information, go to favorandcompany.com to download the guidance for a healthful living environment for fraternity and sorority chapters.